In this video, we'll look at how to use our ASP.NET file manager with a Dropbox account. I'll show you how to set up the Dropbox account for our app, and then we'll look at how to add the file manager for both ASP.NET and MVC extensions. First, sign in to a Dropbox account. Next, click on the Additional Menus option here and choose Developers. On the next screen, select App Console and then click the Create App button. I'll choose Dropbox API App. For the data type, select Files and Data Stores. For the next question here, choose No, because our app will need access to files on Dropbox. And finally, select Access to All File Types. Great. Now just give it an app name and click Create App. On the next screen, we should see that our app is created. Now just scroll down and click the Generate Access Token button. Then copy the token. We'll need to use it in a bit. In my Visual Studio project, I'll add the ASPX file manager from the toolbox. Specify the provider type as Dropbox. Then set the access token value by pasting the token we just got from Dropbox. I also recommend that you change the settings for editing by changing these allow options to true. Let's run the app and make sure it's connected. Great. As you can see, our file paths are the same from Dropbox. Now let's look at how to connect it using an MVC extension. Open the Home Index View and then right-click here in the markup. Then choose Insert DevExpress MVC Extension at the bottom. And our wizard appears. Here, choose the Data tab and then File Manager. Under Binding Mode, choose Custom Provider and click Insert. Now, locate the controller and change the type of the static model property in the added Home Controller File Manager Settings class to Dropbox File System Provider. Also, change the getter code of this property and initialize the access token which we copied earlier from Dropbox. You can also remove this additional code in the controller class. Now, when I run the application, you'll see the file path shows we're connected to Dropbox. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and thank you for choosing DevExpress.